What is it? Good evening, folks. We're on our way out to do some evening glassing. We're gonna go uh, set on some public ground where um, we've seen some nice bucks this year and see if we can uh, we can uh, find out where they're coming out to the field at. We saw 11 bucks out in this field Friday night, last Friday night, and I went scouting a few days ago and uh, found some pretty good areas where I think maybe those deer are coming from, but I kind of want to come out here and confirm where um, they're coming out to the field if they come out tonight, hopefully. So we're we're going to sneak into the uh, backside of the public ground there and get get in uh, get good good position to get the spotting scope out and glass up the field the rest of the evening. So it should be fun. Got the wife with me. She's what 27 weeks pregnant. Yeah, so she's a trooper. Deer number one trip. Well, I guess number three actually, but first one where we can hunt at. So just a doe. Another doe. A little guy. Does, aren't they? Let them play together. Seats, the scopes, the camera, everything's in there. So now we just gotta make the trek back there, which is not very far. Just gotta cross a creek. Double check to make sure I didn't forget anything. Because I usually do. So this is the same place I was at uh, in I guess vlog number two. Um, so we kind of make our way back through here and get to the creek. And cross it again. That's the toughest part of the whole walk, so you're good. We're almost here to where we have to cross the creek. It'd be a really short walk to this spot if there was a better log down somewhere, but there just isn't. Nope. Yep. Like a balance beam. Now we just gotta find a good spot to set up and we got through the creek. Well, we just got set up here. I'm not quite as close to the field as I wanted to be just because deer were already out in there when we got up here. But uh, there's a big buck uh, out in the field. There's some turkeys out there I see now. So I'm going to try to get good footage of him. But it's tough um, just because we're kind of back in the woods a little farther than what I wanted to be.
some more action out in the field. There's uh, three small bucks and a, uh, a doe out there now. A bigger buck. I don't know what happened, but something kind of spooked him out of the out of the field. I don't. I'm 100% sure it wasn't us. He was bedded in this finger that comes out in the field, and just all of a sudden he was running out of that woods. Uh, went up into the hills. So, but good deal. now more than eight. That's a good deer. That's gonna be a good deer.
best ones out there right now. Maybe like a 130 inch uh, nine point. Pretty good deer. You can just see that it's a little older than the rest of them. Maybe a year older. That's a good up and comer. That's a shooter this year. I'm pretty sure that's a shooter this year. That's a nice deer too. a little more mature deer. That's a, that's a little guy, two and a half year old probably. That's a good deer. Man, there's a, there's a few good ones in there. See him posturing up to that little guy. <laughs> Well, that was a fun, fun evening. Saw uh, three or four pretty nice deer. One that was particularly nice that uh, probably would be a, a shooter uh, this coming year. Um, I think we saw probably a total of uh, 11 different bucks that came out in the field and a couple does. So, so it was a good evening. It was a, it was a, it was a fun evening. Um, hopefully this year we can get on one of those and... Uh, if you guys like my vlogs, please subscribe. Let me know what you think of them, and we will see you on the next one.